Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to do a college vlog, but it is going to be quite different than my other college vlogs. In case you haven't watched my channel before, I go to the University of South Carolina. And as you may could guess, we're not in school right now and we're completely kicked off campus. And I personally live in on-campus housing, like an apartment that's on campus. So I can't get to my apartment right now. We're not having class there or anything. And now we are doing it's been weird getting adjusted to but the thing for me is that it doesn't even feel like you're going to school because I mean you're not you're not going to school it just feels like you have a crap ton of homework all the time it's combining literally everything we would be doing for homework with the stuff that we would be doing in class and it's just a lot it's definitely a no for me dog if you guys are in school I know it's online and I know you're dealing with the same thing because I pretty sure the entire country is online right now all those poor parents that are having to deal with their children 24 7 but anyway i hope you guys are okay and that you're hanging in there as best you can hopefully within the next month or two we're gonna see some improvements and get this thing out of here because i'm tired of it but yeah i have some schoolwork to do today an exam to take today so i just wanted to bring you guys along for you know a little day in the life of you know zoom university i'm not even using zoom i'm using blackboard collaborative but i think it's funny that people are now referring to their school as zoom university because you know that's basically where we are right now to start off i'm actually in the parking lot of dunkin donuts you might be able to see it right there and we can't go inside so i'm going to go through the drive-thru and get some breakfast and coffee can i do a bacon egg and cheese bagel on an everything can i also do a medium ice white chocolate flavoring and that's my favorite but I think it's seasonal um which I don't understand because it's really good and I would get it all year but you know it's not up to me I just got vanilla because it's a you know always a solid choice so now I am going to join my Spanish class live stream sitting in my car and using the Duncan Wi-Fi because currently our house is selling we actually accepted an offer recently and we're moving which is so crazy because i've been in the same house since i was like six years old and i'm going on 20. so it's basically been my entire childhood there but i am excited for a new house and usually i live at college anyway so i'm not really going to be living there much the realtor and the inspector are going through our house for the next like three hours or so so we're not allowed to be there and you know nothing's open and i need to do school so i am gonna like i said use this duncan wi-fi and try to get my schoolwork done I've used their Wi-Fi before and it's been fine and you know we gotta make do don't really have much of an option right now because I'm kicked out of my house my class is gonna start in like three minutes so I'm gonna try to set this up <laughs> let's see I wonder if there's a password I need Dunkin Donuts guests okay I think I'm on so I'm gonna go to blackboard which is like the site that my school uses for all of our grades and live streams I actually got pretty lucky because I don't have live streams for every class and there's pros and cons to both and a few of my classes are doing like optional live streams and I honestly like going on it because for me I'm more disciplined when it's live than having to watch a whole lecture on my own time like I just don't want to take the time to do that because that's boring but when it's live I'm like forced to pay attention which is good and then I can also ask questions and stuff this is being really slow and not loading but I will update you guys when I get it going which I hopefully will soon Quiero que piensen el tema de la nueva unidad es sobre drogas, narcos y violencia para representar nuestras opiniones y pensamientos. If you can't understand that, it's because it's my Spanish class, but I'm actually minoring in Spanish, if you guys don't know. I hope to be fluent one day. It's a big goal of mine. It has been for a while. So right now my professor can't see me or hear me clearly because um, it would be rude to vlog if she could. All she's doing is basically explaining this upcoming unit for class. I think she's asking a question, but I'm not paying attention. I probably need to focus and stop vlogging. <laughs> sí, Emma. Hola, también yo estoy de acuerdo vender sus prescripciones a otros que no tienen un prescripción. Hi, I'm home now and it's actually like five hours later. I got home probably around noon and it's going on five o'clock now. I ended up taking a pretty bad nap when I got home, but it was much needed and I've just been chilling, not doing anything. And I still have an exam to take and some work to do. So unfortunately the time has come to do more school. 
I'm just in my room right now. I actually don't even have a desk at home besides our room downstairs has one, but my mom's working down there and stuff. So I think I'm just gonna sit on my bed and take my exam. I'm gonna try to get myself set up real fast. I don't think there's any sort of webcam or like lockdown browser, which is what teachers or professors will use to make sure you don't like change tabs. Honestly, I had one class over the summer where they would record you taking the exams because it was online. And it's just like so weird to know that your professor has like an hour long footage of you like doing a class I don't know weirdly enough that's how like most classes are right now over zoom and then the blackboard collaborate that we use I honestly can't even like I shouldn't even feel weird about that because I'm putting my face on the internet but also I'm in complete control of this so you don't see what I don't want you to see like if I mess up talking or say something weird I you know I can just cut that out and try again but that's not any secret I think I'm going to study a little bit more for my exam and this is actually my third online exam I've had in the past two weeks my professors hate me and they've been throwing all this at me so fast but this one's probably going to be the most extensive one I've had, so I am a little bit worried about it. This is for my anthropology class, and the questions that we've had on tests before, or like quizzes before, just always are very in-depth. So I really do need to still make sure I know what I'm talking about. It really does feel like online classes give you a pass to slack off, just because it's so weird and it's really time managed by yourself. But of course my goal is to still do good because I put so much work into classes for half of the semester. I just need to finish it out strong. So yeah, I am going to do that now, even though I'm not excited. after my exam hopefully next time you see me i'm in a good mood and it's not too long because i don't have time to sit here for an hour and a half but that's probably gonna happen i'm gonna stop procrastinating see you guys after sorry for the boring intermission i'm actually not as excited about how that exam went as it appeared in that clip i honestly think i did fine but the questions that she asked everyone i read i'm like you're really gonna ask me this. Like, you're really going there right now. My camera ran out of storage, so I just deleted a whole bunch of stuff and now I'm back. I think I was just saying how the questions that she asked are so hard. It's over with, so now I don't have to think about it or worry about it anymore until I get my grade back. Now that that's over, I think I'm going to go to a huge party with my friends. I'm kidding. There's nothing to do. I wish I could do that. But for all, I really don't know what the rest of my night is going to consist of. I'm going to try to do a little bit more homework just to set myself up for success, but I don't know how well that is going to go. And then maybe do some self-care stuff because surprisingly, I haven't really been doing much of that even though I've had plenty of time to. So I feel like that would be a good idea for tonight. Hi guys, it's a little bit later now, but I actually was successful in finding a face mask. It's a watermelon energizing sheet mask and it's supposed to moisturize and soothe. And I actually stole this from my mom. I don't know where she even gets stuff like this from, but she had a few to choose from and I thought this one looked like the most fun. I definitely need to take off the little bit of makeup I have on right now before I apply this and then I'm going to put this on and just chill for the rest of the night. Like watermelon, which makes sense because I literally can't pick myself seriously. <laughs> I don't even know what I look like. Like I don't even know what the description is. My face is still shiny from that mask. It's really late. It's literally like 2.30 a.m. I don't know why I'm such a night owl. It's just like there's something peaceful about being up at night. I always find myself still up at hours I probably should be sleeping. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for almost a thousand subs. That is super awesome. So please make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and leave a like on the video. I will see you guys in the next one.